Driving is all about going with the flow, whether you're in stop-and-go traffic or just cruising at the appropriate speed. With Active Distance Assist Distronic and Active Speed Limit Assist, your Mercedes-Benz can help you do just that. First, we'll talk about adaptive cruise control called Active Distance Assist Distronic. This feature can help you maintain a safe distance from the car in front of you. Engage Active Distance Assist Distronic by pressing the on button in the left cluster of buttons on your steering wheel. To cruise at the speed you'd like to maintain, press the speed control button and take your foot off the accelerator. You'll notice the cruise control icon on screen to indicate Distronic has been activated, as well as the red notches alongside the speedometer indicating your selected speed. Now, to set the distance you'd like to keep between you and the vehicle ahead, toggle the distance button up or down until you're at your desired range. You'll see the distance increments in the instrument cluster display. The feature can help maintain the vehicle's set speed and accelerate or decelerate depending on the distance from the vehicle in front of you, and can help in coming to a complete stop if needed. If you're stopped, you can resume by tapping the accelerator lightly when traffic starts moving again. You'll also resume automatically if stopped for just a short period and your path ahead is clear. If you want to accelerate or decelerate manually, toggle the speed control button up or down until you reach your desired speed. When you turn off the engine, this memory is cleared and you'll have to reset Distronic when you restart the vehicle. Distronic can't predict the behavior of other vehicles, may not detect narrow vehicles like motorcycles, and will not react to pedestrians or stationary objects. Remember, even though the Active Distance Assist Distronic feature can assist you by adjusting the vehicle's speed, you must continue to steer and to monitor the road ahead for hazards that may require you to brake or steer to avoid them. You can get the most out of Active Distance Assist Distronic by pairing it with Active Speed Limit Assist, which can help keep your speed paired up with changing speed limits along your route. To get started with Active Speed Limit Assist, first make sure Active Distance Assist Distronic is engaged and ensure the speed limit function is enabled in your Vehicle Settings menu. Press the Active Speed Limit Assist button on the left cluster of buttons on your steering wheel and the technology can detect posted speed limit signs, even digital ones. The feature can help adjust the vehicle's speed depending on how the speed limit of the road changes, and the new cruising speed will display in the instrument cluster on your dash, as well as your heads-up display on your windshield if activated. If the speed limit decreases, Active Speed Limit Assist can adjust the vehicle's speed down. If the speed limit increases, it can speed up. If you need to disengage Active Speed Limit Assist, simply tap your brakes or accelerator, change your cruising speed in the Distronic system, or press the Cancel button on your steering wheel. If you drive a long distance with no speed limit posted, the system will cancel the feature. The system may not work if traffic signs are ambiguous or dirty, and low visibility may affect functionality. These features are designed to assist you in driving but you're always fully responsible for your vehicle, so stay alert and attentive while driving. Mercedes-Benz Active Assist technology can help make driving easier and safer, whether you're in the city or on the open road.